So my name is Linda Vanderbeek and I do the transtympanic infusions for sudden sensorial hearing loss. So basically um, a transtympanic infusion um, is a high dose of liquid steroid delivered right behind the eardrum with it hopes in the middle ear space with the hopes of getting into the inner ear where the damage has occurred. We lie you back in the chair, we uh, put medicine called phenol um, on your eardrum which helps numb up the eardrum. We take a little wisp of cotton to take the excess off. Then we put the, uh, the medicine in, right behind the eardrum with a needle uh, with the high dose of liquid steroid. You'll sit there for 10 minutes. After the 10 minutes, we come back, we'll look. If it needs another infusion, we'll add more uh, steroid. Sit another 10 minutes, go home with a cotton ball in your ear. Um, that can be taken out one hour later. Um, when you shower, there'll be a little hole in your eardrum. Uh, you need to make sure and use a cotton ball with Vaseline. Uh, while your showers. So the transtympanic infusions, the, I mean, it's, it's a shot, it's not pleasant, it, it's achy, it burns. When I put the medicine in the ear, you can get some dizziness. If you get some dizziness, then you basically hold your finger about six inches away from your nose and stare at it, and that will subside pretty quickly. People, you can taste it, it doesn't taste pleasant, so we, not only because it doesn't taste good, but also because we want as much medicine in that middle ear space, we have people not swallow. Sometimes when, you, when we do these infusions, there could be a little bit of blood on the cotton, which is completely normal. Um, your ear uh, drum has a lot of blood vessels, and that's just sometimes part of it. We do a series of five infusions. Um, typically, we do them on a Tuesday and Thursday. Um, so that would be about a two and a half week um, course. So three weeks later, we'll test your hearing uh, to see if there's been any improvement. If there has been improvement, um, if it's completely improved, then we just bring you back in another six weeks, make sure it's stable and make sure it's not going down. If they recover partial hearing, then we will talk about doing another series of the infusions to see if we can't get more back of the hearing back. If there's been no improvement, then we'll, again, we'll bring you back in six weeks, monitor you. Even though they may have not gotten any hearing back, it doesn't mean they're not going to.